Hey, Javon, when uh, Drew and then Mark are in a little foul trouble with a lot of time left, it, you guys didn't seem to panic or anything. What, what, what's going on with the team at that point uh, when you still got about nine minutes to go? Uh, you know, everybody on the sideline just uh, just saying, just stay focused. Uh, we got a lot of guys that can go out there and compete, do the things that we need to do. Um, you know, like everybody keeps saying, we're an older team. So, um, you know, we got guys that have been here before. So just going out there, playing our game, um, not changing anything, going out there and do what we can do best, uh, just playing hard. Okay. Yeah, Javon, I, when Oregon got within five, I think X hit about a 23, 24-footer there from the top of the key. Has he kind of developed into a guy that, that really seeks the ball out, that, that wants kind of that moment when the other team's making a charge? Oh, yeah, that was a great shot. Um, you know, at our, he's our point guard. Um, he's been working on his shot a lot. Uh, you know, I think it was a pick and roll play, and um, he came off of it and knocked the shot down. It was a great shot. Um, you know, he could do those type of things. Um, you know, he just doing whatever he needs to do to help the team win. Ben Hawkman. Um, Conzo was saying, Javon, that numerous players on the team like guarding the best player on the other team. When you hear that or when you see that, how does that make you feel as a teammate? Uh, make you feel good. Uh, just knowing that guys want to step up to the plate, um, go out there and challenge themselves. Um, they feel like they can do what's best for the team. Um, whenever another guy gets tired, just knowing that we got somebody else that can go out there, uh, go out there and take that challenge. So uh, it's it's real good. We work on defense a lot. We got a lot of good defensive players on our team. So just going out there and um, just helping out one another on the defense end. Mitch. Javon, you all shot 21 threes, I think, in the first half. But then in the second, uh, it seemed like you and X were doing a lot of your damage getting to the basket. Um, was that a clear directive from the, the coaching staff at halftime, or was that just, just taking kind of what the, uh, the Oregon defense gave you all? Uh, really just taking what the defense gave us. Um, they was telling us we was going to get 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 our shots, just be patient and stuff. Uh, once the press was broken, we was able to um, get to the basket, get those layups, um, just make those baskets around, I mean, those shots around the basket. So uh, it all just planned out well with the press. Yeah, you know. Uh, Eric? Over the past couple of years, Javon, it seemed like this team is – in a couple injuries away from really doing something productive and getting closer to the tournament. Now that you guys are 2-0, and and especially after this one, does it feel like it's the start of something grand? I know it's early in the season, but does it feel like this is the right way to do things for you guys? Oh, uh, yeah. We've been excited uh, ever since that we came back with one another, um, making sure that we're um, doing the right things with our body, making sure that we're um, staying healthy. You know, that's always a big part, like you just said. Um, just making sure that we staying connected, going out there, uh, you know, doing the right things whenever we off the court, wearing our masks so we can all be together. We know how special this group can be. And so that's just our main objective. Uh, anything else, Javon? No?